Here with brand new head men's and women's tennis coach Drew Fernelius. Drew, first of all, welcome to the show here at Bethel University. And second of all, you started practice this week with your team, or excuse me, last week. Tell us what it's been like, what you've been able to see from your teammates so far in that first week of practice. Well, it's been a long time coming. Haven't been here now, uh, now since uh, since last summer. You know, it seems like I've been here a long time, but just getting started. Just really excited to get going. Uh, players have been practicing with captains practice weeks, a couple weeks before I'm going. Just great to get out on the court and see what they've got and looking forward to our first match. Well, you talked about what you've been able to accomplish, but um, so far it's all been indoors, and obviously that's a little bit different feel for the players. Obviously for a coach, you're teaching different things. What really is the mentality right now as you're indoors at uh, different venues across the city? Well, you know, here we're really blessed to be able to practice at Lifetime Fitness, just you know, top-rate indoor facility. It makes a huge difference for our program and for, and for being able to practice. Uh, Minnesota tennis, a lot of people don't realize Minnesota tennis is a lot indoors, and people don't realize that we are starting right now in our first match this Friday. So we're excited for that. I'm excited that our players really are working really hard, and they're dedicated and, and uh, putting it all out there. Yeah, so you mentioned again now the first match this Friday. You uh, have the opportunity to go toe-to-toe -to -toe with another competitor. You get St. Scholastica, a competitor in the UMAC. What are you expecting to see? What are some goals that you have for your players as you start uh, competition? Well, we start out the year with a, with a difficult schedule right off the bat, playing St. Scholastica that's got a couple kids from England that are some top-ranked players, and go, then going against St. Cloud State, who's got uh, who's been in a national tournament level at, at the Division II level for the last 12 years. So, you know, we, we jump right into it right away. Our expectations are being uh, competing, one through six, singles and doubles, and uh, we'll uh, see where the chips will fall. Absolutely. Well, we appreciate the time. Best of luck this weekend, and uh, hopefully many more videos to come. Thanks much.